Hey, what's going on, YouTube? What's going on, you guys? So, I don't know if you guys have been paying attention to some of my videos where it looks like I'm like hindering my ankle. Um, my ankle is still stiff. I sprained it back in one of the videos that I had showed you. I sprained it pretty bad. Um, currently, I don't, I don't know what's going on, so I'm gonna go to the doctor, go to the hospital, and see what they're talking about. Um, I've been debating on going to the hospital because I hate being inside of hospitals. You know, when you go to the hospital, honestly, nothing really good comes out of it. And this is something I've been dreading to do. But unfortunately, um, being that I have a couple of big things coming up, I'm gonna have to just bite the bullet and actually just go. So right now it's pretty early in the morning. Um, I don't like really waiting on lines. I like being one of the first ones in the urgent cares and the doctor's offices. So right now I'm gonna take you out with me today. I'm trying to get an x-ray. And if the x-ray is like, you know, negative, then I'm gonna try to set them up, have them set me up for a rapid um, MRI test. Just to let me know that I'm good. You know, that it's just a healing process and I just gotta go through the whole thing of just relaxing and letting it take care of itself. Um, that's the best case scenario. Worst case scenario is uh, something's wrong. Knock on wood. So we're gonna see. Um, We just gonna see. I ran up a check, I might do it again. Enemies close, have me thinking they friends. Ten toes down, I'll be free into the end. Crib outside the city, I don't feel safe in my hands. Took so many years, I'm just waiting for the wins. I'm in debt to no one but the one who took my sins. I do it for real, there's no reason to pretend. If I do it once, I do it again. Add it up, add it up, bank roll, bank roll, your roll, your roll, pay so the God be the glory, all blessings, you heard? I think one of the toughest things about about heading to the doctor, especially in New York, is my doctor or my urgent care is like walking distance. So while walking there, like I'm contemplating and thinking every single thing that could be going wrong. You know, I had a bunch of friends and a bunch of people telling me like, yo, just go to the doctor, go to the doctor. And I'm like, uh, you know, because you like know your body, you know it. And I think, I think me jumping on my ankle too early trying to play actually might have hurt me now i'm praying it's nothing serious seriously like i got some big things coming up for myself and you guys that i think would take this channel through the roof you know i think it would take this channel through the roof so hopefully this doctor just like yo it's nothing you just need a couple of more weeks of rest but I'm almost certain the, the x-rays is gonna come back negative. It's just the MRI. I wanna see if they can give me a MRI today. I don't wanna keep thinking and wondering, you know, am I good or am I not good? But we're gonna speak all this positivity into existence and make sure we know we good. Cause if I don't got me, God got me. All right, I got here like about two minutes early. I'm about to turn the corner. And hopefully, what I'm hoping is no, it's no line, you know? They do like the, they do like the COVID line. And you know, you can't go inside until everybody's, you know, I hope they ain't doing that. Let's see. Hell yeah, this line is long as hell, man. What the? It's long, long as hell. I finally got inside the room. I don't know what they're about to say. <clears throat> but I guess we about to see. So the doctor just left and told me that my ATFL, which is the ligament that goes across my ankle, uh, right here, 
is uh, pretty much swollen. So I guess I gotta focus on rehabbing that. He told me just to rest and not get too crazy. But that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Exactly what I'm gonna do. They're about to still give me an x-ray just to give me an update. This process is crazy though. Because like I said, I don't, I sprained it pretty bad. Like I said, if you guys haven't seen it, you gotta check out the vid, but you know, sitting here waiting to go to the x-ray, it's just like the what ifs, you know what I mean? But he told me just to keep ice in the area and just to chill. So I think I'm just gonna focus on, you know, the recovery process and relaxing, you know, staying away from everybody. Um, the scary part is just seeing everybody that's getting tested for the COVID stuff. Like that's, that's a little, little scary, you know. Um, and for you guys out there, I hope you guys are wearing your mask and, you know, putting your hand sanitizers on. I'm gonna try to see if I can take you guys in a room with me with the x-ray and stuff like that. That'd be cool. Just like looking at all this stuff in here, it's just like, knowing how to wake up this morning. I, ain't, I wasn't even gonna wake up this morning and go. I wasn't even gonna go this morning, I'm telling you. I was gonna lay in my bed like, ah, just ice it, just take care of it. But I'd rather just know than not know. You know, the doctor was just telling me like, you know, if I don't have a sprained ankle as a basketball player, and I'm gonna tell you guys, if you don't have a sprained ankle as a basketball player, you gotta ask yourself, are you playing really hard? You know, are you, are you guys really, you know, putting in that work? You know, defense and all that, offense and all that. Crazy. Now I'm just waiting for the x-ray technician to come in here and come get me. It's like my heart is beating fast. I think the thing that I'm most worried about is because I kept hooping after it. You know what I mean? Like for my own self and also to bring you guys content, but I kept hooping after it. Like I kept trying to push it, kept trying to push it. And I just, you know, hope like I didn't do anything really damaging to it. That's what I'm concerned about. You know? And I don't know if they're gonna make me change because I don't know if I can go inside of the, the room with pants on. Although it is only my ankle, so I might not have to change it to a gown. But yeah, the one good thing is having college degrees and, and the physiology side is dope. You know, so I kind of knew what was going on, but I can't self-assess my own body so that's why i came to the docks i already been waiting for an hour and 30 minutes so trust me i'm not i'm not happy about it but you got to get in when you get in yeah yes how you doing? Hi, my name is Ray, and I'm gonna be doing your exit today, okay? All right, we got good news or bad news when I do it? You think it's gonna be good? Figure out. <laughs> <laughs> so you can leave your stuff here and just follow me this Okay, way. copy, copy. Right. Let me pull it. All right, I got you. We're doing actually the left side. Okay. The left side. Officially back inside, so I couldn't get you guys to see the whole the whole process but the doctor's about to come in here and talk to me and we're gonna see what's up like i said hopefully we're good she said the, the x-rays look pretty decent but we're gonna see right now it's funny because when i was doing the x-ray i felt like a little tingling sensation in my ankle i don't know what that was about i don't know if that could have been anything could have been mental but whatever it is i know it was just like Caught my attention. So obviously you didn't break anything. All right, all right. That's what I like to hear. Uh, what I'm, but what we are gonna do is, uh, I'm waiting for the radiologist to give me the read. These are the people that actually have like really nice computers and they can see like the nooks and crannies of your bone. Okay. Uh, but like I said. If it was broken, you would be able to walk. Yeah. Right? So, yeah. Um, I'm gonna put you in a little Spanish. Okay. So I give a little bit of support for right now. 
Um, and then, I forgot what the actual brand is. I think it's called like, like Big David's or something like that. I know like what that. you're talking about. So yeah, there's a huge ankle brace, or it's like an ankle sleeve where you put it on, mm -hmm. and there's like three wraps. One that goes on, and then you wrap it around your ankle. I think That's, I did see that. Yeah. Okay. Because I used that one after I played basketball, I tore my ankles apart. Mm -hmm. um, it works. Okay. It still hurts after, because it's like literally you're aggravating the injury a little more here mm -hmm. and there. But after a while, it, it felt better. So okay, cool. Try I, that. I know I'll be I'll be flying out soon to compete in basketball, so I just want to make sure that I'm at like. When a, you say soon, how soon is that? Uh, three weeks. Four okay, weeks? I'm, I'm assuming you'll be okay by then. Okay. Okay. But if if it doesn't, then time to call your doctor, get some physical therapy on you. Okay. All right. So that means you could play if you tore your ankles a couple of times. Well, it's because I suck. <laughs> and the other part is I'm not as I'm not an athlete like you are. So. <laughs> yeah, appreciate you, copy. It was more after med school exams we all decided to go play. No, nah, I understand. I understand totally. <laughs> all right, cool. So, right. so you want me to just wait here, or? Uh, so I think you should be okay. We're just trying to working out your paperwork. Okay. If the radiologist reads something different, yeah, I will give you a call. And let you know. Okay, cool. But I don't expect anything. All right, okay? cool. That's perfect. I right, appreciate you. Hey, Ivana, it's okay if I let him go, or? Okay, cool. Okay. Alright, never mind. In no minute. Do you want to disc with your x-rays? Yeah, I mean, I could, yeah, I'll look at them. Okay, let's get with this. Yeah, he wants to disc. Yeah. Alright, give me a minute. Okay. So I guess they're going to give me a disc with the x-rays. Um, as you guys get heard, you know, he'll let me know if the radiologist sees anything else from the nooks and crannies. You know, most of the x-rays have the bigger, the bigger bones. You know, when they send it up to the bigger computers, you know, it gets the little fine fractures and stress this and stress that so <sighs> let's get out of here so finally back inside the crib as you guys can see went through that whole process my heart's still beating a little crazy they told me that they're gonna hit me back and we gonna see what's up um right now i'm gonna look up some ankle braces to make sure i'm still good i can still get a little crazy i'm probably gonna take like a week and a half off maybe two weeks tops just keep doing the repetitive nature of like the ice and 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 all of that uh yeah i need it i need it i need to make sure that i stay good for you guys and for myself you gotta make sure i keep playing at a high level um since the channel's been taking off and it's been going up a lot of people been calling me out a lot of people been wanting to hoop a lot of people been you know trying to play 1v1s and stuff like that so i want to make sure that i'm good to do that because if you call me out you better bring your a game because i'm gonna bring mine don't let the, the YouTube aspect, you know, fool you and think that this is only, you know, content related. Like, there's a lot of work that goes behind, you know, closed doors. You know, it's in the trenches. So, we're going to keep this going, man. Um, probably going to work out today. Probably won't record that. Probably like a nice little kettlebell workout. Get a little crazy. But, um, yeah. Appreciate you guys for stay, sticking with me. Staying tuned to the video. Um, you know, support me through this time. All the people that hit me in my DMs, all the people that text me, let me know, Matt, you know, stay healthy, stay well. You know, we gonna stay, you know, stay on this narrative. And if you watch this video, like I said, the Overlook docuseries is out now. Make sure you catch up on episode one, two, whatever's out. Please do not miss out because it's your boy. All right, later.